Hey YouTube, this is Carrie Scrapping for a Dart. Quick video. Um, I get a lot of server components in and I don't always show you what's inside of them. Um, this is a really heavy unit, probably 40 pounds. Um, it's kind of dark in here. Let me see if I can get the light over here to show you a little bit better. There's one of the ends. You can see how large it is on my tailgate. It takes up at least half the tailgate. Um, inside, um, I took the top off, which is over there. And you can see the board in there that's heavily populated with a lot of good stuff. Um, these windings are really heavy and they're about the size of my fist. You, two of those are and uh, there's a lot of good copper there. I know it kind of looks like aluminum but when you cut into it you'll see a copper color which is, means it's number two copper. So over here there's this plastic heat shield. I took the screws out already. The cool stuff that's under there is all those heat sinks. Um, these are considered uh, 6061 category at your yard. It's a higher quality aluminum and you get paid more. I think I get like 60 cents a pound for that stuff. So you definitely want to separate your heat sinks. And then there's a little motor there and then there's some wiring. And also there was some batteries in here that I already pulled out. And we'll go over to the vents here. So I already broke down another one of these things. So this shows you basically um, what the board looks like when it's depopulated. All these goodies here were on this board and I pulled them all off already. Um, you can kind of see, not much left. Uh, there is some gold connectors on these. Um, my, I'm gonna check with my yard, but I'm pretty sure they'll buy this at my motherboard rate. Um, it is a green board and it does have gold um, pin areas and that's what they look for when they buy these. Um, I get about a dollar a pound at my yard for this, or I could ship it away and make about two, I think I'm about 260 a pound right now, but I'd have to ship it. And I'm starting to just sell this stuff at my yard because it's a lot easier and the packages are heavy. They're at 70 pounds sometimes. It's just easier for me to sell it here and move on. I wanted to show you some of the other things that were in there. Here's those large windings. Um, they're just at different places on the board here. And then I took off the heat sinks. Um, almost all of these will be are considered dirty until you take off like uh, some of the mounting screws. These here where these connectors are, you got to pull those off. Um, so what I did here, these are heavy duty, so I, let's get this thing fired up and show you the weight on these. Once it clears out. Okay, so just one of these, I know it's dirty, but it's almost a pound. So you can tell that we're gonna get a lot of weight out of this. Okay, just those alone is four pounds. So um, and I've got another one over here in my vise, another large one. And I wanted to show you if I can do this with one hand. These have little rivets on them that make them dirty. So if you just take your vice grips and you grip it and you just shake it back and forth, if you can see that or not, but now it's clean because I got rid of that piece of steel. So that's what you want to do um, to make more money on this stuff. So we'll pull those off. And I also wanted to show you um, this um, winding in particular by itself is a pound four ounces okay I think that goes as a motor rate at my yard so it'd only be about eight cents a pound so that's you know a little about ten cents or so but if you break off the ferrite and just have the piece of copper you put that on there and that's close to six ounces um, I'm getting almost ten cents an ounce I think for copper right now number two so it's like a dollar sixty a pound so you can do the math there so just this piece stripped is worth way more than all these transformers together as a motor rate. So on these larger um, windings like this, you definitely want to pull them apart. Okay, and then also inside, there's a few like some more little heat sinks. These are like a real thin aluminum, hardly any weight there at all. Um, these boards have a lot of things that are hidden. There's like these little plastic covers that you can pop off and underneath you'll find more windings. So you want to look at your boards especially these ones. I mean, they don't add up to much weight, but when you start getting a lot of these, you'll get a little bit of weight. But there's a bunch of this kind of stuff. And uh, basically, that's about it. That's what's in this thing. I think the, just the steel itself, I think I said was like 20 to 30 pounds, so probably 20 pounds in steel. So I went ahead and did the math, and everything here adds up to about eight bucks in scrap. Um, and I had 13 of these units, so you can see how fast this stuff will add up. And I've already broke down some. There's a tarp over there. You can see I still got quite a few to go. But anyway, this is basically what's inside of one of those server components that I get. Um, in this case, you definitely want to pull everything off the boards um, to make a lot more money. And I guess I could weigh this board for you. Just to show you, two and a half pounds. So, you know, 
get about a little over two dollars for this at my yard and that was added, added into the estimate that I already gave you so um, it just gives you an idea again of uh, what you can do when you get the stuff pull it apart if I was to sell that is is at my yard 30 cents a pound or uh, actually I'm only getting like two and a half cents a pound I think for an appliance rate so that whole unit over here would have only been worth about 60 cents compared to eight bucks so um, you definitely want to pull this stuff apart I hope you guys like this video. Please like and subscribe. Take care.